animal and plant cells by kscience.com. What I'm drawing here is an animal cell, an animal cell, and this is the cell membrane of an animal cell. This here is the nucleus of the animal cell, the nucleus. These are the ribosomes, the ribosomes of the animal cell. These are the mitochondria, the mitochondria of the animal cell. And all of these organelles are in the cytoplasm of the animal cell, the cytoplasm. We're now going to describe the function of each structured organelle of an animal cell. So these are the ribosomes, the ribosomes. And as you can see here, the ribosomes are building proteins. So this here is a protein that the ribosome is building inside the cell. So ribosomes produce proteins. So ribosomes produce proteins. This organelle of the animal cell is the mitochondria. It releases energy during respiration. It releases energy during respiration. So the mitochondria releases energy during respiration. It releases energy. This is the cytoplasm of the cell, the cytoplasm. As a gel-like substance where reactions take place. This organelle is the nucleus, and the nucleus stores DNA and it controls the activities of the cell. So this here is the nucleus of the animal cell, and the nucleus stores DNA and it controls the activities of the cell. So this is the cell membrane of the animal cell the cell membrane, and the cell membrane controls what enters and exits the cell. It controls what enters and exits the cell. So substances like oxygen, glucose, and other molecules that the cell needs. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. So now we're going to look at a plant cell and describe the function of each of the plant cells, structures and organelles. This here is the cell wall of the plant cell, the cell wall. And this here is the cell membrane of the plant cell, the cell membrane. So this here is the cell wall. And the cell wall protects the cell, so it protects the cell. And the cell wall strengthens and supports the cell strengthens and supports the cell. So when we say that the cell will protect the cell, these represent microorganisms that want to enter the cell. But because of the cell wall, many won't be able to, because the cell wall protects and strengthens and supports the cell. So this here is the cell membrane of the plant cell. So a plant cell has a cell membrane just like an animal cell. And we said that the cell membrane controls what enters and exits the cell. So as you can see here, this represents substances entering and exiting the cell in both the animal cell and now in the plant cell. This is the nucleus of the plant cell, the nucleus. It stores DNA and it controls the activities of the cell. This is the nucleus. Plant cells also have ribosomes. So as you can see here, these ribosomes are producing proteins. Ribosomes are the site of protein synthesis. Synthesis means to produce something. So ribosomes produce proteins. Plant cells also have the organelle mitochondria, which release energy during respiration. So the mitochondria release energy during respiration. Respiration. Plant cells also have a cytoplasm, the gel-like substance where reactions take place. Plant cells have a permanent vacuole, a permanent vacuole which stores sap. 
So the yellow represents the sap that is stored in the permanent vacuole. So this here is the permanent vacuole, the permanent vacuole. And it stores sap. So you can see here that sap is stored in the permanent vacuole. What I'm drawing now are the chloroplasts, the chloroplasts in a plant cell. So these are the chloroplasts, the site of photosynthesis in a plant cell. So the chloroplasts are the site of photosynthesis. So both animal and plant cells both have a cytoplasm. Both animal and plant cells both have mitochondria. Both animal and plant cells have ribosomes. They both have a nucleus and they both have a cell membrane. Plant cells have a cell wall and animal cells do not. Plant cells have a vacuole, but animal cells do not. Plant cells have a chloroplast and animal cells do not. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. And if you're stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes.